What's up, YouTube and Terra Two video in today's YouTube video. We're gonna be going over this crazy Hell of City update that's gonna be coming later this month. Man, only thing I gotta say is this update is gonna be absolutely massive, man. There's so many new stuff coming to the game, man. This is gonna be if this, if this update, if everything in this update comes out at once, man. Everything I show you guys in this video that comes out at one time, this is gonna change Hell of City forever. And this may be the biggest Hell of City update of all time. Cause this is gonna like change the way we play Hell of City, man. This game's gonna get ten times better all these changes comes out. But guys, before we get into the changes, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe button. That gives me motivation to make these videos you guys. And also I heard people say if you hit the like and subscribe button on this channel, you'll get a, they will get a fifteen percent boosted thermos and your next Hell City server, man. So let's get right into these changes. All right, guys. So the first thing that's new coming to the new Hell City update is a brand new drama, man. And I know this has been a very requested features in the Discord server, man. But it's a I'm pretty sure it's already in Twisted. I only play Twisted that much, but I'm pretty sure there is a drone. But yeah, guys, a drone, man. This drone is gonna be absolutely insane to have fun with. Get the perfect pictures of tornadoes, and uh, yeah, man. For you content creators out there, I know this is gonna be a very very nice thing to have when you're making youtube videos and stuff like that but i'm pretty sure um i i don't think it's gonna be a game pass because i think the leader uh the creator of the game said there's not gonna be any game passes for the game so i think you shouldn't have to buy this so i don't know how much money this is going to be probably about like maybe five thousand dollars at max maybe ten thousand i don't really know yet but it looks like um when you get close to these tornadoes man um it may disconnect you and you have to redo your drone again i don't know how that's gonna work they haven't really said anything about that yet but uh, i really hope when your drone disconnect when your drone disconnects i really don't hope really hope you don't have to buy one again so yeah guys you see the pictures on the screen here and these drones are absolutely fabulous man they're clean drones man they got the little camera on it it's not it's not the most d detailed thing in the world because it's a little drone, man. It's not to be the most detailed thing in the, world, in the world. But yeah, guys, this is going to be an absolutely fabulous thing they're going to be adding in the game. All right, guys, the next thing they're going to be adding in the new update is brand new houses, man. And you can see how these houses on the pictures on your screen that these houses are going to be absolutely insane, man. You can see the textures, the houses. So there's going to be upstairs houses. And only thing I got to say, they are detailed. But I don't know. So I don't really know if they're going to have furniture inside the houses or not, if I'm going to be honest here. Cause they, cause one person in Discord server did ask to bring furniture inside houses, and the creator did say they don't really know about it yet, cause it's server lag and uh, FPS drops when the tornado hits those houses, all the props flying everywhere. So I don't think there's gonna be furniture inside these houses, but these houses are absolutely insane. But guys, this is gonna be insane for the game overall, cause in this next update, we got a brand new city or town coming in the game man this town is absolutely insane and they gave us a little quick sneak peek of the town and the only thing i gotta say to say guys that this town is gonna be absolutely insane is i don't think it's gonna be bigger than molica by this picture but as you can see we got some storage houses or storage buildings and we got some houses in the back so i think this town is gonna be like the same size as elmhurst a little bit maybe uh, I don't think it's going to be big as Molica because that's, I mean, this is the only picture they sent. It could be bigger than Molica. I don't know yet, but this, but they also teased a brand new house coming into this town too. Look at the picture right here. So it isn't like it has any furniture in the house, but yeah, guys, this is a different type of family house. It's like pretty nice. It's a pretty nice family house, man. But I think this is going to be in the brand new, this house is going to be in the brand new city because you can see there are two white houses in the back. And uh, and this new and in this little quick town sneak peek, you can see these two houses in the back too. So and this uh little red house, and if you go back to the picture right here, the red house is right there on the right side. So I think I think this new house, or whatever, is gonna be in the brand new city. So I don't know what the if, where the city is gonna be at. Um, I wish I could probably bring the Hell City map up real quick, but um, yeah, it's gonna be in a, probably in an empty spot in the map that like a town really needs to be. So I think it's gonna be in a spot where like a barn is. They're probably gonna replace that barn with a city. So I'm pretty excited. All right, guys, the last major thing that's gonna be coming to this update is a brand new tib, man. I I I I, th I think they're gonna bring a a tib one and a tib tib two. I don't think they're gonna be one two. I think it's gonna be both tibs, man. But y'all can see on the screen, these new tips are going to be absolutely phenomenal, man. Oh my goodness, they're detailed. They're ready to go. They're ready to intercept these storms, man. Oh my gosh, they got the hatch at the top of the vehicle. Oh my goodness. I don't even know the mechanics this car is going to have. I don't even know the details about the tip and stuff like that, but it's at least going to be doing wind speeds over 250, man. This tip is going to be absolutely a monster in these storms. But the only thing I got to say about the tip is it's probably going to be a little bit slower than Dominator 3. 
Um, it's gonna be really slow actually. So I don't know traveling around on this thing's gonna be like the slowest thing. Where I don't know what the wind speeds even are, but uh, no one's really said anything about the wind speeds yet. But guys, oh my goodness, this tiv is gonna be absolutely insane intercepting these storms, man. These these this this tiv, man. This tiv, man. It's gonna be absolutely ridiculous, man. I got the hatch on them too. Oh, this card's looking clean. So they're, they're gonna have the tiv one, tiv two. Now the prices, I don't know about prices. I think people have been saying. 300k to 400k maybe 250k i don't know it's probably be at 250 to 250k to that 400k price range so if you guys want to get this tip i i recommend saving up like 400k if you want to get one of these tips man because um i don't know because it's gonna be tip one and tip two so man oh my goodness we're gonna have, have we're gonna have an insane update coming so it's gonna be absolutely insane man all right guys next thing that's coming to the update is that the creator of the game is now going to be remaking the tornado progression system. So, um, EF4 wind speeds can't go over 200 miles per hour. So, they're just going to be uh, remaking the system. Uh, maybe EF4s go a little bit higher. I don't know what he's going to do with their tornado progression system. Probably going to change the way how tornadoes expand, how the wind speeds increase over time with the tornadoes. So, I think it's going to be a pretty good change coming to the game. But, yeah, guys, this update is going to be absolutely amazing, guys. But when this update drops, I'm going to be the first one on YouTube making these YouTube videos for the update, man. So you guys stay subscribed, have his post notifications on because our YouTube video is coming right out when this update drops, man. I'm probably going I'm like, I'm to be the first one to have it up. I don't know. If, if the update comes out next week, I probably won't be able to make a like a, a gameplay video on it. But I will be able to make a news video because I will be out of town. So... That's kind of annoying, but it's alright, it's alright, it's alright, because I'm still going to be bringing you guys that news. So thank you guys for so much for watching. Maybe, let me know in the comments how you feel about this update, man. Uh, personally, for me, this is, sounds like a 10 out of 10 update for me. I'm very excited for this update to come to the game, because I feel like it will bring this game to a whole nother level. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.